Well, once again, everyone, I am Merlin Sensei, and this is my real life dojo. It's time once again to open up our monthly loot crate. It's time for June, and the theme of June has been cyber. So hopefully, we're going to see a whole lot of cool stuff in here. Uh, there's been some talk of uh, some like Terminator stuff, and honestly, I can't remember anything else that I heard was going to be coming out in this particular loot crate. But without any further ado, let's go ahead and take a look, shall we? Now this crate, look at this crate. This is a big crate. This this crate, look at the size of this crate. This is like a shoebox. I mean like a big shoebox. Like we're talking size 14 shoebox right here. Let's go ahead and pop it open. As always, you guys are going to go ahead and get the very first peek. I hope you guys are ready. There it is. I don't know what you can see, but hopefully it's cool. All right, what do we got? Holy shnikes. All right, we got a couple of things in here. All right, number one, yeah, we got ourselves a nice little T-shirt here. Let's take a look at that. Oh, nice! Check that out. Can you guys? Let me just. Yeah, look at that. Optimus Prime in all of his glory. That's pretty cool. Reminds me of the Transformers movie. You got the touch. You got the power. Yeah. If you guys have not seen the Transformers movie, I mean the animated movie, like the good one, not the crappy live-action Shia LaBeouf bullshit or anything like that, uh, definitely go watch it. Uh, what else we got here? Ooh, holy shnikes. Uh, okay. We got ourselves a Terminator... I can speak words really well. A... Terminator Genesis brain chip, apparently, and I think all that is is just a um, keychain. Like, yeah, it's just solid plastic. I don't even know if it's metal. I don't think it is. That feels kind of weighty. Might be metal. But yeah, there's a keychain right there. Yep. I don't know. I got. Yeah, definitely metal. I've got enough keychains, so eh, whatever. It's still kind of cool, though. Uh, a half-scale endo skull from Terminator Genesis. Is it? Is it just like? I don't. I honestly don't think it does anything. I think it's just a replica endo skull. Yeah, that's all it is. Plastic endo skull. I mean, it still looks cool as hell. I mean, look at that. Where is John Connor? I don't know. Is anybody... Is Terminator Genesis even out yet? I don't know. To be honest, I completely lost interest in the franchise um, when Terminator 3 came out or whatever because, in my opinion, Terminator 3 was terrible. But again, that's just me. But still, this is some cool stuff. I mean, for anybody playing uh, Warhammer 40K or anything like that, if they want a cool prop, then this could you know, work as a servo skull or something like that. I mean, it's still pretty cool. Uh, what else we got? We've got a, uh, pencil bag? I'm assuming? Yeah, looks like a nice little, you know, pencil bag with all kinds of cool, uh, like microchip, uh, kind of designs on it and stuff like that. That's pretty sweet. Uh, we have a patch, uh, for something that I do not recognize. No, it's definitely this way. Almost looks like owl eyes with something. But hey, we'll figure out what that is soon enough, right? Ooh, ooh, what is this? Okay, now this is badass. We have a Loot Crate exclusive Borderlands mouse pad. I believe this is the Assassin. Uh, might be Borderlands 2 feels really nice though like this is a solid mouse pad and that is freaking awesome uh, we've got our little uh, monthly booklet that tells us everything that we have and we'll go ahead and get to that in just a minute right, because we've got one two other things in here mm -hmm. All right, Battlestar Galactica range sheet command issue cross rank service for range facility use only what is, what is that? Oh, wait. Like a shooting range. Oh, we've got some uh, Battlestar Galactica. 
what's it called? Um, targets of um, I have not seen Battlestar Galactica. What are they called? C Cylons, right? Yeah. So that's kind of cool. Might have to go ahead and I don't know. I I probably personally won't use them because I've got nothing to use on them. If that makes sense. Like I do not own a gun. I do not own a. Uh, bow and arrow, I don't own a crossbow, I don't own anything like that, so, you know, whatever. Uh, we've got our, uh, join us for Nerd HQ 2015, uh, in San Diego, July 9th through the 12th. Yeah, got some stickers, that's kind of cool. Um, and then, of course, you can't forget our Loot Crate June 2015 Cyber, um button right there that's pretty cool uh, and then is gonna go ahead and be it for our loot crate uh, looks like we can go ahead and mess around with the box in general and have it look cool um, I don't know I might figure that one out later but yeah not too shabby I mean we got some cool stuff in there I'm super pumped about that mouse pad uh, the shirt was freaking awesome and I even like the pencil case I'll have to go ahead and get some um, mechanical pencils for uh, when I go to D&D uh, &D and stuff like that. So let's go ahead and check out the magazine really quickly just to make sure that we got everything that we're supposed to get. More human than human is our motto. Is our motto. Uh, that's from uh, Elden Tyrell in Blade Runner. A uh, picture of some of the stuff from the previous month, uh, which I absolutely loved. Uh, the previous month was so amazing. Uh, let's see now. Talking to Mr. Robot, I suppose. I am not familiar with who that is. Uh, Loot Crate at Comic Con 2015. Uh, word search puzzle, and it looks like a coloring page, perhaps? Maybe connect the dots? No, I can't tell. Uh, here's all the stuff that could have come in the Mega Crate. Let me go ahead and show you guys that really quickly. Okay. Uh, which would have been really cool to go ahead and get because it would have had like a tablet, a graphics card, uh, Borderlands loot chest, just all kinds of really freaking sweet stuff. But we weren't that lucky this year. Uh, what's up here? An interview with Zachary Levi, creator of Nerd HQ. What else do we got? So yeah, we've got the exclusive Nerd HQ sticker sheet. Uh, sticker sheet. My mistake. Uh, the exclusive Prime T-shirt, which looks very cool. Exclusive Borderlands Zero game mat. Uh, t -t 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 Terminator Genesis Endo Skull replica. Terminator Genesis Brain Chip keychain. Yeah. Um, the uh, Future Replicant Corporate logo patch, inspired by the sinister biotech company that made some of our favorite film replicant replicants. This custom embroidered patch can be sewn or ironed onto lab coats, robes, shirts, or backpacks. Where and you'll be more human than human. Ah, I'm going to go ahead and assume that that's another Blade Runner reference. My mistake for not remembering Blade Runner off the top of my head. Uh, Battlestar Galactica Cylon target poster. Glow in the dark circuit ba uh, gadget pouch. Oh, so it glows in the dark. That's kind of cool. And yeah. That goes ahead and does it for this month, guys. Not a terrible uh, loot crate at all. Uh, some really cool stuff in there that I'm excited to have. And I want to say thank you to the people at Loot Crate. Um, and thank you to you guys for watching. Now, just as a quick reminder, you guys, I do live stream constantly. Like every single night. I'm going to go ahead and put the uh, link up on the screen right about now. And uh, go ahead and leave it there for a second while I tell you guys. Um... I get started about 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, 11 p.m. Eastern Standard Time at the absolute latest, depending on how things go in real life. I play a lot of Binding of Isaac Rebirth. That is kind of my bread and butter game. But we do do other things as well, such as a game by the name of Darkest Dungeon. We just got finished with an amazing 24-hour live stream in which we played some Hotline Miami, uh, some Bully, some Max Payne 3, and all kinds of other cool stuff. So feel free to go ahead and stop in, say hi, give a follow, and, you know, just all that good stuff. And it would be greatly appreciated. 
But that is it for me this week, you guys. I have been Merlin Sensei. You have all been absolutely amazing. And of course, until next time, guys, bye for now.